and that's two details on Ready to fly. Yeah! Hey, it's Mr. Marshall uh, with Mesa RC Foam Pies. I got Ashton here. He'll be prototyping and uh, made in his MF15 Eagle. We're working hard on this, man. Yep, it's been a good process of design. Yeah, so you've been working on the design over the summer, and then once we started back up, um, we went through probably what, two or three builds in yep. order to get what we want right now. And then there's a few minor, real minor adjustments up in the cockpit area. Um, but other than that, we think we're ready to rock and roll. Yeah, it looks pretty good so far. So he is running two ailerons with one elevator setup, and uh, we're using a Grayson uh, Super Mega Jet because the plane is a little bit bigger. So we are using a bigger motor just to make sure that we have enough pop. And then um, on your build, what were you going to do when you finally get yours? I was going to split this uh, elevator. It's really ginormous. I was going to split it in half and just do l bonds for myself. Perfect. So um, stay tuned for that because I'll make one like this and then you're going to make one with the split um, flaps so that uh, to show the viewers that you, know, you don't have to do the other on style. Um, the other thing uh, that you did differently was this whole bottom piece you made all one instead of like the 18 where it had just the middle and then just yep. the wing separate, which made the plane a lot uh, stronger, a lot more sturdy, and uh, it made it way quicker to build. Yeah, it, it was super quick to build, probably two or three hours. Yeah, I mean, um, and for any like super um, um, scratch build guy, they could probably get it done in an hour, probably, yep. if they really do it really fast. So anyways, let's get up in the air. All right. Cool. Oops, sorry. All right, heads up, here we go. That CG was perfect. The elevator was perfect too. So we uh, he extended the elevator on this point too. It's got a good roll left and right. I think you're good, man. Yeah. Don't be scared. Last plane flew the main well. Vertical is pretty good with the Super Mega Jet. Nice, this thing flies like it's on rails. All right, you ready? Yeah. I'm gonna fly around again and give it to you. Just take your time.
There you go. If you like your dragon, just give me one more throw. Hey, that's a good throw. Good job, bud. There we go. Perfect. I just like the fact that you have a lot of control. Yeah, it's almost too much. For you? Yep. Okay. But, but you're great. doing it. Up, 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 up. Hit for everyone else at least. Okay, go. Oh! Maybe lost something a little important. Uh, that's okay, man. This thing is sweet. Are you filming? All right, Ashton. Um, well, first off, when I when I was flying it, hands down, the best plane I've ever flown with the scratch build. Yeah, it felt great when I was flying it too. I mean, you have this is a lot of control. I mean, this is more like beginning at the intermediate wrap right bat when you have the ailerons, and mm -hmm. you were doing fine. Just that one little dip that doomsday area right there where yeah. most kids have that hard time of now transitioning and inverting the ailerons and uh, on the control sticks wind might have caught it too wind caught it and i couldn't i just couldn't bring you up fast enough but um other than that dude you've got an awesome plane mm -hmm. um talk about use a new esc uh a supo right yeah this is a supo 40 amp it's a, it's a little bit different. It's the new Supo designed by Supo, and we got it from um, uh, Garrett over at Altitude Hobbies. He wanted us to try it out. And with uh, the Super Mega Jet, I mean, it was a little warm. It is 90 degrees today. Mm -hmm. But uh, for the most part, it was it did a really good job. Yeah, it did. No glitching, no, nothing um, wrong with the motor, but um, you got yourself an awesome plane here. Good. So the next steps would be finalizing the... The canopy. Okay. And then making my own and making your own. Okay, so we'll do a build video um, after our maiden flights. We'll do our little maiden flights with you guys and hopefully have both, our goal will be have both of these up in the air at the same time. Yep. So hopefully we'll get Chris Miller over to help us out with yours and kind of go from there. And um, this thing is really, really cool. I'm gonna do a Jolly Roger theme. You're gonna do... Uh, I'll figure something out. Do a camo or something like that? Yeah. Cool. Well, awesome. Thank you for this, the prototyping. Um, he's in the design process of his MF-15, so he did the prototyping testing today. We've got ourselves an awesome product. Yep. And so now we just need to calm it down to fit um, his style of flying, and we should be good. All right. Cool. Thanks for watching. Just making this in sight here, coming out of the top there. Just the quarter inch. Yeah. And I think, I think too, that this is just... Okay. All this stuff seems to be perfect. perfect. Um, I did scale these up. Alright, so they look. Yeah,